hit this with no hey guys it's me again and welcome back to the legend of zelda the wind waker medley listen carefully to what i am about to tell you the temple ahead is the nest of an evil creature the same creature that stole the life of your predecessor the sage it is a dark and frightening place that is why if you do nothing else then at least do this okay if Link comes near you and presses R to call you, then be silent and follow closely behind him. And if Link presses A... <laughs> sorry. Allow him to lift you, and if need be, fly and carry him through the air. And Link. If Medley gets stuck and cannot continue in the temple, use the Wind Waker to conduct the song you learned in the Tower of the Gods. Do you understand? Mm-hmm. Link, protect Medley, and Medley, protect Link. The power to repel evil shall surely be returned to the Master Sword. Okay! By the way, I totally ship these two. <laughs> They're just so cute! Alright. Here we go, Medley. Are you ready? Oh, wait. Apparently I'm not ready. Sorry! There we go. Not too hard to remember, actually. I mean, the first time it did take me a little bit of time to remember. But, once I got the hang of it, it wasn't so bad. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> and there it goes. And I know I'm gonna regret this, but we're gonna do half a dungeon, and then I'm gonna stop my recording session to finish the other half at another time. Or maybe not. Unless I want to stay up till 3 in the morning again, which is, uh, is a very distinct possibility, I must say. I was going to say, you got to follow her, Link? You're just kind of standing there. Like, just half a second too long, Link. You don't need to be that dramatic. Okay, so... Yeah, this isn't hard. Just hold her, and then we jump like that. Boop! Alright, so now, I always want to use boop as a sound effect, I don't know, it's just cute. Okay. Okay, okay, Medley, you wait here. I'm gonna go kill the baddies for you. Boom, surprise attack! Oh, snap! Oh, that was so epic! Oh, I think that deserves an instant replay. I'm gonna get you! I'm gonna get you! I'm gonna get you! I'm gonna get you! Ah, uh, that didn't work. I swear, the, the moblins get harder and harder as time goes on. Well, I mean, they're really hard at first because you don't have a sword. But once you get your sword, they're not so bad at first. And then just, I mean, in a previous episode, one of them even jumped off a cliff for me, so... I don't know what was up with that. Anyone else? Yep, one more dude. I think it's just better to clear the room of baddies before, you know, we take Medley into the heat of it. Into the heat of battle. Oh, she's... Shoot, he stabbed me. Ye. LOL! You can't hit me, cause I'm defending. I'm such a dork. <laughs> okay. Um, let's see. I feel the need to pick up the rupees anyway. Even though my wallet is totally full. I need to go to the fairy islands to get the better ones. Okay, so... Come on, Medley. Let's go. What's wrong? Well, Link. Oh yeah. I'm not very confident, but I think I should try to fly. I'll fly where you tell me to. Just tap A to keep me airborne. Okay, whenever you're ready, just use the Wind Waker to guide me. Okay, let's go. Come on. That's so cute! That's so cute! Oh, I love this little escort mission. It's so adorable. It's not even an escort mission. She helps you. All right, here we go. We gotta use this one. The one I was using, the th <laughs> that face. That's a thumbnail face right there, I gotta say. <laughs> Keep it up, Medley. You'll be a perfect sage in no time. <laughs> okay, not too bad. Oh, I could've landed perfectly. There we go. Oh, that's right. Yeah, uh, we can't, hang on. Yeah, okay, I know what to do, I know what to do. 
Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Come on, Medley, fly. I forget you can't run off a cliff to jump like you can with Link. Okay, no, wait, let go. Return. First, I have to... Link, I'm feeling a bit more confident now. I'm not sure how high I can fly while carrying you, but I'll do the best that I can. Just pick me up and jump, okay? Mm-hmm. All right, so she's doing better now, I guess. Hmm, okay, hang on. There you go. Come on, Medley, you can do it. There we go. All right, so now... Wait, I drop you here. I stand on this switch, and then I command you to fly on the other one. That's right, this puzzle isn't hard. It just requires that you have to think, and I can think really well at 1.30 in the morning, for sure. <laughs> All right, you ready, Medley? Go, fly! Fly, Medley! Okay, so now we just stand on the switch. There we go. Did that open the door? I didn't even see. It worked. All right, so, I wonder, if we call her from down here, will she come? Nope, she won't. I have to possess her again. Perfect. This is kind of actually, like, pretty annoying is that, you know, their AI isn't really that smart or anything, but I don't know, it could be worse, I guess. Whee! Perfect, ah, excuse me, perfect descent. Alright, Medley, let's press forward. Except I think you actually have to be carrying her to go through doors, I forgot. Great. That's perfect. Okay, hey, crap! Uh, Medley, you might want to stay here. I'll get rid of these guys for you. Blah. Oh, wouldn't it be cool if Medley could fight with you? That'd be amazing. I'm so attached to her that I have no problem killing the bad guys while she just kind of watches. So, I remember the purple guys. They don't die when you hit them normally. I believe. Here, let me just try real quick. Yeah, they just break apart. That's right. You have to bring them into the light first, and then pick them up and throw them once they turn to stone! It's pretty epic, actually. Come on, you can do it. So you're pretty much totally safe from these guys, as long as you're in the light. It's pretty awesome. And you can also put them on switches and stuff, because they're like really heavy and whatever. So, whoa! But these regular guys can just be killed with the sword slashes. Whoa, Chew Jelly! That's good for our spoils bag. I like spoils. It's fun. Alright, so did I just... Can I throw him onto the other guy? Well, if my aim was better, maybe I could. I don't know if it's ever actually succeeded for me now that I think about it. Alright, I just had to kill all the Choo Choo's, and no! Whew. Just watching it disappear really makes you want it. Here, let me just... Can I break this? I uh, guess not. Maybe? Hmm. Okay, so let's go, Medley. Ow! You just ignore that, okay? Don't tell Kamali about that. It'll ruin his vision of me. What? <laughs> that was a totally legit, legit reaction. I forgot about this. I totally forgot that her weapon is reflective. I thought we just had to move on and find the mirror shield later, but no. That that comes later. Much later, I guess. More later than I thought it would, apparently. <laughs> just, just that legit, legit reaction. That was amazing. Okay. There you go. Shine bright like a diamond! I think that's just the effect. Alright, so... Here. I can shine them at these dudes too, right? Yep. At least like a little a little light imprint there. Day of school. Excuse me, Link. You're kind of in my way. There you go. Alright, return. And some magic. I don't really need magic. Okay, definitely before we go to the Wind Temple, I'm picking up those upgrades from the fairies, because I totally forgot about them. I need a new wallet. I need a new magic bar, I need a new bombs, I need a new quiver for my arrows. <laughs> I sound so spoiled right now. Shut up! I play Zelda better when I have more stuff. 
It's, it's uh, unchanging law. It's just a, it's just a fact. Okay, next room. Forgot about this room. That's creepy. That's a really creepy. All right. I feel better about having uh, Medley in the light. So that's where I'm putting her. You got it? Okay, cool. So I don't think I can do anything in here, so never mind. Let's go, Medley. We gotta do something else first. Oh, I need the key. Oh, I need the key. Hang on. Oh, that's right. I forgot about this. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Medley. Let's control you for a minute. If only it didn't go through this entire animation every time I wanted to control Medley. This would be a lot smoother of a transition. I think it does in the HD version, so at least Nintendo understood. Like, understands now, I guess. So if I just point this right... Yeah, I think it's just right there. And... Just keeps doing that. Then I'm able to hit this with... No! <laughs> I just wasted some of my bait. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> oh, my legit reactions to things are super legit. I meant to go into the items and I'm st How am I still used to, to Chibi Robo? Is that just the game that I play the most on the GameCube? What? I didn't mean to do that. I meant to do that. Link, calm down. Calm yourself. What? What happened? How am I in this stuff? Weird. Well, now I'm in the light, so I'm good. Look at him shiny! Medley's instrument is making me shiny. <laughs> Okay, never mind that. Come with me, Medley. Hmm. Is there something in there, too? I guess not. We'll, we'll figure that out later. For now, let's go through this door. It probably has a key in it for the other door. Uh, I have a really bad feeling about those coffins, Medley. Stay here. Oh, I thought they were re -deads. I thought they were re -deads. I was so scared that they were re -deads. They're not re -deads. But, I don't know, they are kind of annoying. But I'm so glad they're not re -deads. I'm just so used to seeing them come out of the coffins that I guess I just thought they were re -deads. Can you blame me? What's at the top of this ladder? Not much, it looks like. Well, let's pull this, I guess. It'll reveal something for us. Yes, the light! I forget about that. So that was necessary. Uh, okay, Medley? How close do I have to be to her to call her? I have come to the conclusion that Medley is deaf. I literally have to be this close to her for the call to work. Uh, if I if I tried to inch my way closer every other time, it would just say crouch. So... I didn't... mean to do that. What is with me in the button miss... miss presses? Miss clicks? Not miss clicks. I don't know what's up with me. That's weird. Okay, you know what? I don't even freaking care. Whoa! Okay. Let's see. Uh... This is great commentary. Perfect commentary right here. I'm just glad that Medley's shield is reflective. Now let's be shiny for this cutscene. Because everyone likes being shiny. Yeah, I'm shiny! <laughs> Kinda has more of a lackluster effect than I thought it would. But I'm shiny, and I got a small key. Okay, let's go, Medley. What? No, 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 no. You're not taking Medley this time, you. Um. No, 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 no. Perfect commentary right there. Oh my gosh. Oh, I had a heart attack. I thought Medley was going to be taken. I mean, not that it's that bad when she's taken, but, I mean, it's, it scared me way more the first time, but, you know. Oh, these hands are so annoying. I mean, like, they are pretty scary, too, actually. Like, they're not as scary as the re-deads, obviously, but still, ah, pretty scary. Alright. Let's see. Well, I just know. One of them's gonna pop out and steal Medley. And I'm not okay with that. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. 
Oh, that's right. Okay, got it. See, I was thinking about that for a second, but then I realized maybe that wasn't the right thing because then Medley would be taking my hands. I already killed the hands, but they'll come back. But I don't know. I have to put Medley on the switch so that I can go through the door. But then she'll be in the darkness and she'll be vulnerable to the hands. I can't have that. I don't want Medley to be kidnapped. Okay, Medley, just stay there. Uh, never mind, forget I said anything about anything. Let's... Medley? Medley? There you are, she's just in the beginning. Phew, all right, here we go. Well, what are you supposed to do now? What if I throw Medley into the fog? <laughs> no, I'm not gonna do that because then she'll be trapped. And I won't be able to get her back out. Uh, oh, we have a key now, duh! <laughs> Silly me. We have a key now. How do I forget things like this? It's pretty important to the game. Now, for some reason, this room I remember so well. Maybe it's because I saved here once and then came back and played later. That could be part of it, because I do kind of remember that. Ah, uh, give me the chew jelly! Alright. Whoa! Oh, jeez. Don't sneak up on me like that, man. Nope, they're falling from the ceiling! Why are they falling from the ceiling? Well, I mean, I guess they always did that. But why are they falling from the ceiling? No! Ow. That's not good. That's bad. That is very, very bad. Wait, wait. I know what to do. I remember what I'm supposed to do. Uh, is that? Let's see. No, not ice. Oh, crap. This is bad. Wait. Hang on. Can they get me from up here? Let me back up a bit. Let's do that. There we go. And I'm gonna set those on fire. Maybe that's why this room took me so long, because I literally couldn't figure this out. I didn't realize I could use the fire arrows to just burn these curtains off. I'm gonna run out of arrows, though. <laughs> oh, stop it, Link! To be fair, this is kind of a small target at such a weird angle. Ugh! Oh, wait, no, I did it. There we go. So that one should have the light behind it. And... wait, no. Go back into the viewing mode. There you go. Perfect. I mean, not that that really does anything for me, but... It's got magic. I think I can get that with my boomerang, actually, so... Let's do that. What? No, I didn't... Come back. I didn't mean to do that. I meant to do... That! Whee! Thanks for the magic, boomerang. You're a swell friend. Come and get me, punks! I didn't mean to step on the switch. There we go! Come on. Alright, here we go. Nope, that doesn't work. Did I not do it right, or is that just not programmed? Because I don't really have any idea. Well, there we go. I kind of wish you got a special kind of chew jelly from that, but I guess your spoils bag isn't really big enough. All right, come on, Medley. So you need to stand on one switch, and I need to stand on... Don't push me! Rude! That was rude of you, Medley. You don't push me off the switch. I guess she just wants to be close to you. I respect that. Um, uh, I mean, this isn't really a friendly dungeon, is it? She just wants to stay by something that she knows isn't going to kill her. <laughs> okay. I shouldn't be laughing at that. I apologize. There we go. Now, how the frick, how the, oh, that's right, I forgot. Ah, Medley, fly! Fly, Medley! When in doubt, fly, I guess. Except that doesn't work, because now she can't push this. Her actions are kind of limited. Hmm. I wonder, hang on. I'm starting to remember why I remember this room so well. It's because I couldn't figure this out. You'd think that since I've played the game already, I would know what I'm supposed to do. But, no. WAIT! No! I do remember! I do remember what I'm supposed to do! Come here, Chigelli. You get over here. Maybe that's why they spawned again. Get over here! Get over here, you freaking frick fracks! There we go. I'm gonna destroy two of them, just so that I don't have one, like, bothering me. 
Come here. What happens if I let him go away on my head, but I'm still in the light? I'm curious, so I'm gonna do that while the, I'm waiting for the other one to come closer. And this episode is out of recording time, but I don't care. I'm gonna record a little longer. I guess it just won't. Okay, fair enough. So, I gotta make sure he's in the light enough that he won't just, you know, unfreeze. So, I think that's good enough. Oh wait, no. No, we have to climb up the stairs, and then Medley is the one who stands on this switch. Ah, oh, that makes me nervous though, because she's gonna be right next to the Chew Jelly. Well, then again, there is the light between them, and um, the AI travels in a straight line, so it shouldn't be too hard. And they're both practically in the light anyways, so... I guess I shouldn't be too worried about this. Except that I still am worried, because I feel like I'm getting flashbacks here of what actually happened when I left Medley there. What happened? Oh jeez, that scared me. Oh, that scared me and the music stops too. Oh jeez. I keep anticipating that something bad is going to happen. Oh jeez. Okay, come on, Medley. I don't, I don't like this. I'm getting a really bad feeling about all of this. <sighs> you guys have no idea what I'm feeling right now. Okay. It would be nice if Medley could fight, but then again, it doesn't feel like a normal escort mission because we actually care about her and we understand why she wouldn't be able to fight. So, you know. I just think it's so cute that you get to carry the characters on your head. I mean, especially considering how big their heads are in proportion to the rest of their bodies. It's just so cute! Okay, Medley, you stay here. While I figure out how to get rid of this guy. Probably sword. I'm good with sword. No! Oh, oh gosh! I'm just so on edge! Why am I so on edge? Ooh, I got a red rupee though that I can't hold. Isn't that great? Well, I'm out of recording time for now, so I'm gonna have to start a new recording, so, oh, please. Thank you all so much for watching, I'll see you in the next episode, bye!